Uh, hi there! Today I'm going to be talking to you about seeds. Um, so just as a brief description, a seed is an embryonic plant um, that is enclosed in a protective coat. Um, they are a product of sexual reproduction uh, in plants and they typically only germinate under ideal conditions. Um, however, seeds uh, that have adapted to the areas that they've been growing for a long time may have an evolutionary trait uh, called dormancy, in which case they will forego the ability to germinate under ideal conditions until they are ready. Um, so uh, in dormancy, there are three different uh, varieties. So mechanical dormancy is when a seed develops a really hard coat um, so that it can withstand the weathering of time and climate action until the perfect opportunity to germinate um, perhaps years down the line. A physical dormancy in a seed is another type of dormancy. In this case, the seed is enclosed by a layer of protective material inside the seed. And this has to be broken down either by a long period of chilling or a long period of heating. Um, and this is an adaptation that developed uh, due to seeds overwintering in harsh winter climates so that they didn't germinate in December when they were going to freeze and die. Um, the third type of seed dormancy is a chemical dormancy. And in this case, a uh, chemical either within or without the seed must be present or absent for the seed to germinate. Um, a common example of this would be uh, serotony, in which case the seed uh, needs um, the additive of smoke and fire and ash uh, to germinate. Um, yeah. Okay. <laughs> that was, yeah, that was doing good. Yeah, I'll just kind of. Here, for, for anyone who wants to read this that can't, so here's, we'll kind of pause and take a look at the information that was, that was put on there. There's some good descriptions of what all of these mean. Go over here. Mechanical dormancy, physical dormancy, chemical dormancy, and a nice description of the physiology of the seed. All right, awesome.